Sabbath school. Um, thank you for coming. And if you have your Bibles right now, you could turn to Genesis, Genesis chapter, um, Genesis chapter seven, just seven. And I'll give you a minute to turn there. And when you're there, then I will read it. Do you know anybody who's 600 years old? Well, actually, it says in Genesis 5, all the way down to the bottom, it says, in Genesis 5, verse 32, says, Noah was 500 years old before he had son. He had three of them, Shem, Ham, and Jeff. Japheth. Japheth. Um, and then if you go to Genesis 7, it says, When the ark was finished, God said to Noah, The 120 years are up and the people still haven't changed. So that means we have to add 500 plus 120. That makes, hmm, let me think. Um, that makes 620. So actually, he's actually 620 years old, but it's close to 600 years old. As we just read, the people had not changed at all. They were still building houses, having babies, and worshiping false gods. I had seen enough. He told Noah, yeah, that 620 year old guy, that he would cover the whole earth with the flood. And the people of the earth, they didn't, they didn't even know what rain was. They just, they just were having a great time in the sunshine. All this was new to Noah. He didn't even know what a flood was. But he said, but he knew that God would protect him and his whole household. Noah, Noah obeyed God. And he started getting to work on the biggest ship at that time for, for all the world for all the world that whoever wanted to come on could come in. That's why it was big. As he was finishing the ark, he told the people that they could come in, but they just stared and laughed. <laughs> the people didn't come, but the birds did by thousands. Well, you get the idea. Not just birds, animals too. Lots of them. When all the animals were shut inside, Noah invited the people one more time and nobody came. So the angel shut the door. And Noah was... Noah Family waited one, two, three, four, five, six, seven days for it to rain. And after the seven days, the floodwaters came on the earth. In the 600th year of Noah's life, on the 17th day of the second month, on the day all the springs of the great deep burst forth, and the floodgates of the heavens were opened, and rain fell on the earth forty days and forty nights. Genesis 8 says, God did not forget Noah and the animals. God protected Noah so he can protect us too.
I had for prayer. Dear Father, thank you for this day. Thank you for all my blessings. Thank you that it's Sabbath today. Thank you that you protect and know and that you're going to protect us all the days of our life. And thank you for all your blessings. And thank you that it's church. Thank you.